What is an API? If you're still a bit lost and not certain on the definition of an API and what they're used for, just give me a few minutes and I'll explain it to you. API actually stands for Application Programming Interface. You can think of it like a messenger and it takes requests, gets them fulfilled and brings back a response. I'm gonna give you a fun example. Imagine you're a customer in a shop and you wanna buy a potion of knowledge. The shopkeeper then takes your order, i.e. the request, and goes to ask the old wizard to make the potion. The shopkeeper then gets the potion from the wizard and she brings it to you. If you didn't guess in this example, the shopkeeper is the API. She took your request and she brought back the response. The wizard wouldn't know what potion to make if she hadn't conveyed that to him. So what would be a real life example of this? When you check the weather app on your phone, it shows you the temperature for your location and also the conditions. The app doesn't just store this information, it's requesting it from somewhere. And what is taking that request? It's some sort of weather API. If we're trying to get the temperature for your location, the weather API takes the request, probably using your location data, and then it passes it to a system. The system then processes that response, probably having access to weather stations and maybe satellites, and then it passes it back to the API, which brings it to the app, and then it's displayed as a temperature. So what makes APIs so useful? Well, they let different applications talk to each other without them having to build everything from scratch. It allows apps to use, for example, a weather API, which has access to satellite data and weather stations, which would really be unattainable for an app if they had to build weather stations. It would be very expensive. So having access to an API makes it really easy to share data. Let me know if this video was helpful. This is a second in the series of beginner software development concepts, so don't miss the next one. But other than that, I'll see you next time.